in the name of Almighty Allah, the most beneficent, the most merciful. This is the sixth tutorial in Bootstrap tutorial series. And in this tutorial, we will be creating a three column uh, layout or a three column website uh, using Bootstrap. So, using this, uh, you will uh, get the idea of how to create a three column uh, layout and the idea of the classes used in Bootstrap. So, let's get started. So as I said in the previous tutorials that uh, the, the top container should be either container or container fluid and then we have row def class is equal to row and next we start working on the columns so first of all I want to have div 1 and uh, assign this a class of call dash xs dash what and the extra small device this div should take the entire 12 columns okay and call dash sn dash and in the small device it should take four columns and call dash sm dash um, call dash md dash in the medium device it should also take four columns and call dash lg dash four in the large screen it it should still take up the in uh, the four columns so inside this div we will have uh, section one or let's write column one so here we have column one and let's have some styles for that not my style mm. border of Mm, one pixel or let's have a two pixels solid black and a background of background color of khaki so let's assign this to this my style let's assign this class to this div so here uh, we have our column one so this is our uh, first div and now let's copy this control c control v and control v so here we have column uh, column one column two column three and now let's refresh so here we have a three column layout so these are the three columns and let's assign some height as well height of 400 pixels refresh so that's how you can create a, a three column website uh, a three column layout if i um, access this or minimize the browser it means that now i'm on a mobile device so this is take a, take a, taking the entire width of the screen from extra small devices it should take all the 12 columns as i mentioned here now 12 column has taken the column one column two 12 column column three 12 column now if i access this from small device here is our so here is our breakpoint from a small device it should take up four columns as i have mentioned here and from medium device also four columns and from large device also four columns so now this will take four columns till the large screen devices and on the small screen we have 12 columns so basically this is the idea of a responsive website and uh, if this re website wouldn't have been uh, a, a responsive so here we would have uh, a scroll scroll bar but as you can see there is no scroll bar it means that this is a responsive layout a responsive three column layout now if you uh, want to make some changes you can make changes in the um, md devices you can have uh, this should take three columns they should take five columns and they should take 25 8 they should take four columns and from large devices they should, they should take four columns they should take um, two columns five plus two seven seven plus um, six five so now refresh this page and now you can see the difference in large screen Five, five, and this is two. In the medium screen, in medium we have three, five, four. 
so 3 5 and this is 4 so this way you can change uh, the, the width of the column so that's it for this tutorial and see you in the next tutorial and don't forget to subscribe to my channel as more tutorials are coming soon see you in the next tutorial